Hello, my wonderful friend. Let's talk about how to flirt with women. Say these five things to captivate her. Sometimes flirting can feel kind of terrifying, right? You don't want her to take it the wrong way or misunderstand. You don't want it to be creepy. You don't want her to reject you. You want to give her butterflies and make her want to be with you more. You want to enchant her. Does that sound accurate? If yes, you are in the right place because you're about to learn five crazy effective things to say to women to melt her heart. And I have a bonus tip at the end of this video, so make sure you stay with me until the end. Before we dive in, make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell. My name is Melanie. I'm a Christian dating coach for men and creator of Attracting Lasting Love Academy. I am your go-to resource to learn how to find the love of your life and make her fall so deeply, madly in love with you that you get to wake up next to her for the rest of your life. So make sure you subscribe, ring that notification bell, and if you'd like to learn more about working with me in my academy, just go to coachmelanie.com. Now, when it comes to learning how to flirt with women, there are two other videos I'm going to mention that will also help you so much. If you have not yet seen this video on how to be an attractive man to the right kind of woman, and this video on signs that she's just waiting for you to make a move, you need to check them out. I will put links to both in the description below. With that, let's talk about how to flirt with women. The first flirtatious thing, flirtatious line that you can steal and use is I like your and then fill in the blank. The secret here is to be specific. I like your hair. I like your smile. I like your eyes. Or it doesn't even have to be like a physical trait. I like your cooking. I like your laugh. Whatever it is, you want to be specific about this. Everyone on planet Earth feels good when they know that they're good at something or that they have a specific trait that is exceptionally attractive to someone. So rather than just falling back all the time on, oh, you're so beautiful, make sure you mention something specific. It will definitely make her feel like she's walking on sunshine. Now I do have one word of caution with this. Just avoid anything that can come across as awkward, <laughs> okay? <laughs> I, I'm gonna try and say this as tactfully as possible. Avoid comments like, oh, you have great legs, okay? She wants to hear that from her husband, not from somebody who's not her husband, okay? So just avoid the realm of what could be considered suggestive or creepy. Just take my word for it. Comments like that just make her feel like you just want something from her. So even if she's polite in the moment, it will make a high quality woman pull away. So watch out for that. My second line for how to flirt with women, this line you get to steal and use, is I was thinking about you. Okay, that's just adorable. When she knows that you've been thinking about her, that's just like cute. The truth is when we think somebody's attractive, we are thinking about them. And so if she's thinking about you and she knows you're thinking about her, holy cow, that's just adorable. There are simple ways to casually just slide this into the conversation. Oh, hey, I was just thinking about you, something like that. Or, hey, I saw uh, this music that I know you like and it made me think of you. Or, oh yeah, they're showing that movie you like so much and it made me think of you. Whatever it is, very casual ways to just mention it, but she goes, oh, he was thinking of me and it makes her feel really good. By the way, have you ever wondered why you can flirt with a girl and things are like going great and you like get super excited and then all of a sudden you just watch it crumble and you have no idea what happened? Has that ever happened to you? There are plenty of people who are really good at flirting or attracting someone initially, but they don't know how to keep the relationship alive after that. It's awful to get your hopes up, to get all excited, to think maybe this will be that special woman who will love you forever and then just watch it fall apart. Has this happened to you? And do you wanna make sure it will never happen again? Or do you just wanna prevent it from ever happening? You must learn how to take it a step further. Flirting is great, but it's only one part of a relationship. You must learn how to make a woman fall so madly, deeply in love with you that she wants to wake up next to you every morning for the rest of your life. 
The men who know how to do this are the men who are successful in love. And if you're not having the success you want in love right now, it's time for you to learn these secrets too. These are the little known secrets you will discover when you join me in my academy. It is literally the quickest and most painless way to find the love of your life and make her heart yours forever. To learn about the powerful strategies you will learn when you join me there, watch my free masterclass today. Just go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. There's also a link in the description below and a link in the pinned comment. These secrets are your key to coming home to her gentle smile every night. One more time, go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. Okay, my next tip for how to flirt with women is say something like, you make me feel so happy or I feel so great when I'm around you. Everyone wants to feel important, right? We want to feel attractive and wanted. And if she knows that she's the reason you're smiling, it's just going to melt her heart. Again, it's a really good idea to keep it casual when you mention this. You don't necessarily have to say, hey, by the way, you make me happy. Although, if you're in a serious relationship with her, that is adorable. This is one of the reasons why in my academy, I do teach you how to move the relationship at the right pace and how to pursue her correctly. Certain things have to, can only be said at certain stages of the relationship. So it's not that you can't say that. However, especially if you do not know her very good, keep it super casual. Like, oh, I'm super happy to see you today. Or I always feel good when I see you. It's simple, but crazy powerful. Next step for how to flirt with women is going to surprise a lot of people and this is a simple thank you she wants to feel like you appreciate and need her too everyone wants to feel needed everyone wants to feel like they're contributing in some way couples who can open up to each other and who can be vulnerable are the happiest couples and so sometimes being vulnerable enough to accept someone's help and thank them for it it speaks volumes. And the best part is it's really not that hard to say thank you, right? Again, simple, but crazy effective. I have a quick question before we get to our next tip. Are you enjoying this video? I realized that I actually haven't done a video about flirting for a really long time. Would you like me to make more videos about how to flirt with women? If you would, comment flirt in the comments below to let me know. Your feedback does help me so, so much. And if you have any questions about flirting, make sure you leave those in the comments as well. Again, if you want more videos like this one, comment flirt. Okay, the next one I'm about to share with you is very powerful when used correctly. And I'll explain what that means. <laughs> this one is to use pet names, to call her something special that's just for her. You do wanna be careful with this one. Make sure there's emotional closeness first. Like I mentioned, you gotta move your relationship at the right pace. That's critical. However, when there is that emotional closeness and she feels safe with you, Having a pet name can be one of the most adorable things on the planet. It's just really cute. To know that that man who means so much to you cares enough about you to have that special name just for you is adorable. It just is. It makes her feel like she matters to you, like she stands out from the crowd, like you noticed her on a deeper level. Fun fact about women, research shows us that when the man she cares about calls her baby, it naturally reduces her stress. Like that's really powerful. A lot of women do like it. So again, when you have that emotional closeness, you may want to test it out a few times, see how she replies to it, or even just ask her. Okay, are you ready for our bonus tip? Our bonus tip, what to say, how to flirt with women, is say something like, I've got your back, or encourage her. Let her know that you're there for her. Women look to the man they're attracted to, to feel safe, to feel protected. That is never going to go out of style, no matter what the toxic people say, but that's a topic for another day. High quality women, the women who want someone to love forever, a, a woman who's looking for married life, she wants a man who's going to be protective and strong and confident. And just saying something as simple as, hey, I've got your back, holy cow. <laughs> Nine shining armor moment, that's attractive. Now, you've got some quick tips to help you captivate a woman. 
Would you like even more? Do you want to discover how to make her fall so deeply in love with you that you know her tender touch is yours forever? No more coming home to an empty house. Now you have a stunning woman to cuddle on the couch with and feel her soft kisses forever. When you're ready for this level of happiness and love, watch my free masterclass and learn how I can guide you to the ultimate success in love. Just go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. There's also a link in the description below. Thank you so much for joining me, my amazing friend. If you have not yet, make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell and give me a big thumbs up. I want to hear from you in the comments. If you want more videos on how to flirt with women, comment flirting. Do you have a friend who would enjoy this video? Knowing how to flirt with women is pretty important. Make sure you share it with him. Sharing really is caring. And if you don't yet follow me on social media, there are links in the description below. I share exclusive content in my Instagram story, so make sure you especially follow me on Instagram. Thank you so much again, my amazing friend, and have an amazing day. Hello, my wonderful friend. Ugh, I just had a little thing freak out right there. Okay, <laughs> that's fine. Just pretend it didn't happen. Is it crazy that still to this day I hear, yeah, yeah, like what the song that used to, <laughs> that used to go over my end slate? That's funny. <laughs> Comment if you remember those days. I'm actually super curious. Has anybody noticed that that changed? Or does anybody remember when I was there? I've kind of been doing this a long time now. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. Okay, anyway, am I done? Yeah, yeah, I think I'm done. That face helps you think. Word of the wise, try it out sometime. Probably not in public. <laughs>